today we're going to be fishing at Matanuska Lake in the Palmer Wasilla area, uh, close to Kelper Bradley Lakes and the, that general lake system. Um, the Alaska Fishing Game stocks this a couple times a year with some decent uh, Arctic char and uh, smaller lake trout, rainbows, and landlock salmon. Uh, today we'll be fishing with uh, AK High Adventures and Chuki Chuki Chuki, my two fishing friends, uh, also YouTubers. I'll leave their YouTube down in below. Please go leave them likes and follows, subscribes. Catch one. The light just came up. Wow, there's a shit ton of cars now. I'm gonna go try around this island. There's like a, another 30 foot spot over there in the corner. Yeah. Please leave Chuki 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 a yeah. subscribe on YouTube or his it also goes by set it, snag it, dip it. <laughs> You look like you're trying to pee. <laughs> Fish on! Is it baby? It's not that big. Got one! If you look really closely, it's <clears throat> kind of hard to see, but you can see my LED light and some sticklebacks and small landlocked salmon interested in it. They're very small and it's hard to see. I only seen a couple, but uh, I was looking down the whole site fishing and you could definitely see them a lot better. Not sure how far down the GoPro could pick up. We were marking lots of fish on our fish finder, but it was hard to get them to actually bite. They're uh, pretty smart and weren't just biting anything. You really had to have something really smelly like shrimp or a flashy spoon to attract them. Here, we were watching the uh, fish finder for a while and kept seeing a big mark come up to my spoon and then drop back down to Annalisa's shrimp, take a look at it, come back up to my spoon. The fish just really wasn't sure what it wanted to bite today. But uh, towards the end of this clip, I do end up catching one. It turned out to be one of my the biggest fish of the day. So just keep watching and enjoy. Thank <laughs> you. 
21 and a half, 21. 21. 21. That's a keeper. Huh? I'm gonna decent this one now. Yeah. I'm gonna let this one grow and get 20. He let it go. Yeah. This guy don't, eat, this guy don't eat fish. Hey, <laughs> good <laughs> shit, man. Woo! 30, what is that? 10 minutes. 10 minutes in. Woo! That's a nice one. Damn. That's the personal fish at my new canal. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be a hard one to talk, man. Dude, I was just looking like, what the fuck? That, that's a big ass fish. It didn't like feel it. that big at first until I got it about like a little off the bottom. But look at that pink point. Damn it, it's going to start digging out. I'm pretty sure if there's one, there's like a few in there. Right, there's more. We're marking a bunch. Good job, man. All right, guys. Were you guys like at the bottom? I, I, I was like jigging in the like middle. She was on the bottom. They've been following, they've been coming off the bottom to the yeah. middle. Yeah, I think I'm gonna switch out to my pink too because I'm marking over there also. Damn, nice. Dude, that's a nice one. <laughs> and we didn't have to try it a little further out. Right. <laughs> Good job, CJ. That was a really unexpected catch. Uh, honestly, went targeting, trying to catch a smaller lake trout just to catch one this winter. Um, so, Stop. fish that size is a very nice hey, bonus. And made the trip very Finally. well worth it. First time here on this lake. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Let's release it. Let it go. Let it go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, fuck, Mike. Yes. Nice, nice job, one. Good job, man. Yeah. Fishing slowed down a bit after we caught our nice couple nice fish. So I was looking down the whole site fishing, trying to see if I could find how deep the fish are actually. I've seen a bunch of action right underneath the ice and just wanted to check out if they're the small landlocks or some of the bigger arctic char that we're searching for. So that's what I'm doing looking down the hole. Just trying to find some fish. Oh, I see one. We did a lot of hole hopping today, just moving spot to spot, trying to figure out where the right depths we're going to be to catch these bigger arctic char we're searching for and lake trout. We're having best luck at between 20 to 30 feet of water. Luckily we saw because he would have been gone. <laughs> I was like, how the fuck did you do that?
this is a stickle HOA bag I snagged later on into the day. Uh, this would make great bait for the bigger arctic char that we were trying to catch. This is what they're naturally eating and looking for. I'm sitting 